Hi, so if you ever get this, cannot send mail, the connection to the outgoing server or smtpmail.outlook.com failed, then you gotta watch the entire video to learn how you can easily troubleshoot these problems on iPhone. So without wasting any more time, let's go. The first work that you wanna do on your iPhone, you wanna do a little work around for the network itself. Therefore, enable airplane mode for about 10 to 20 seconds, turn it off, and I highly recommend you guys to just switch your network. Let's say you were using mobile data, then I would say turn up your mobile data and go back to your Wi-Fi. Or if you're using Wi-Fi, turn up your Wi-Fi and go back to your mobile data and see if that works or not. Now, let's say you did switch your network, but still you have the same problems, then try following the following process. The next, you gotta verify your email account first. So open up your settings, scroll down, tap apps, and find out your mail app. So type mail, open this up here, tap mail accounts, and you gotta select the mail account that you are having problems with. So let's say you were to try to send the mail from your Gmail, then you have to select your Gmail, and then select account settings, and select advanced. So turn off and on the use SSL, and go back here, and now, all you guys need to do, just simply go ahead and tap cancel, tap delete account, tap delete from my iPhone, and then re-add the exact same account to your iPhone to check if that works or not. Now, sometimes this problem also can happen because of your mail application. Therefore, you can open up your settings and scroll down and tap general, and you can simply tap on iPhone storage and find out your mail app. So I'll just open up my mail app here, tap offload, tap upload again, and then tap rinse lab. It's not, like, it's not gonna delete any for data, but offloading your application can actually help you to solve your problems. Last but not least things you guys can do to solve these problems, you can hit over to settings and then scroll down to general, scroll down and tap transfer and reset iPhone, tap reset and tap reset all settings. Now, after following this process so far, your problem is going to be solved. But last, there are a few things that you guys keep in and out especially to avoid these problems. Now for that, first I gotta open up a mail here. Now first thing that you guys really wanna do here, so make sure that your email address that you're trying to send is correct. And also make sure you're not blocked by the receiver. And after that, your problem is going to be solved. Still, if you guys have any more questions to ask, just let me know in the comment section. See you all around.